What's up, fam? Good day. 30 day live video challenge, day number eight. Uh, I did uh, record my video yesterday, but I was I did, was not at a good, uh, didn't have great uh, reception. So I pre-recorded my video. I'll be posting it later today. Um, Saturday's video was done inside of our group. Actually, Friday and Saturday's videos were done inside of our private Facebook group. So anyway, here I am back on my uh, regular page for day number eight of the 30 day live video challenge. Thinking a little bit today about being intentional about creating daily power in our lives. I've talked a little bit about power in some of my previous posts. What does that really mean? You know, for me, whenever I am in power or not in power is a distinct difference for me. Whenever I'm feeling in power, right, in my power, I'm feeling strong, I'm feeling confident, I'm feeling clear, I'm feeling grounded. I'm able to create momentum in my life and in my business. When I'm not in power, I'm feeling weak, unclear, unmotivated, lacking confidence, lacking strength, lacking fortitude, right? And being in power or not being in power, I found is something that is um, not like accidental, you know? It is something that for me, I have to be very intentional about. And for me, there's a certain way of conducting myself and living my life that either adds to or contributes to my sense of power. Like, why do we even care about power? For me, it's about whenever I'm in my power, right? I'm feeling strong, I'm feeling focused, I'm feeling grounded, right? And I'm feeling like I can not only handle life, but I can take life on, right? I can, ta I can move through life with a more intentional, powerful stance. And I found that for me, there are, there are ways I can live my life, certain daily activities really, right, that I can engage in that increase or enhance my sense of, of, of power. So for me, it really comes down to, right, it's either like won or lost for me in the morning. And it comes down to a powerful daily morning routine. For me, I engage in what's called the core four. People around me, people that are close to me, know about the core four, right? We teach the core four in the Porn to Purpose community. We teach the core four to, the, to our guys in the Liberation Boot Camp, right? Getting in power affects every area of our lives. For, for us, right, there's different variations of the core four. Different uh, people kind of speak to these ideas. But for me, it's daily powerful routine of hitting on these four areas, the four key areas, mind, body, spirit, exercise, meditation, reading, and writing, growing and expanding, activating, being intentional around these key areas of mind, body, and spirit, growing a little bit, activating these key areas. Whenever I don't, so, so for me it looks like getting up early in the morning and engaging in a morning routine, getting to the gym, getting some meditation in, spending some time doing some reading and writing. Whenever I do this, whenever I get up and intentional about these things, I activate these things. I'm strong, I'm powerful, I'm clear, I'm grounded. I move forward throughout the day, right, with a sense of intention, less fear, right? When I don't, I show up weak, scared oftentimes, ineffective, unclear, right? So we can go through life being intentional about our sense of power, being uh, intentional about our sense of effectiveness, or we could not. We could wing it, we could improvise, we could show up, and rather than happening to life, we could allow life to happen to us. So for me, I've chosen to take on a more powerful, intentional, proactive stance in life, starting every day with the daily core four, getting into power, clear, intentional, confident, focused, right? Versus weak, lethargic, waiting for life to happen to me. We get to pick one or the other. Really simple way to begin this practice is by starting with a daily routine. You can start with one hour a day, 15 minutes each. This is what we teach our guys in Liberation Boot Camp, helping them to get into more powerful habits and ways of being. 15 minutes each. Exercise, it can be a start with a walk around the block. 15 minutes of meditation. Don't worry about doing meditation a certain way. Just sit and be quiet. Just be present with yourself. 
do some reading, pick up a personal development book, a spiritual development book, something that inspires you, right? Grow in mind, grow in spirit, and do a little bit of journaling. Journaling journaling's a really cathartic way to focus the mind, to clear the mind. It's a great outlet for us, right? So do some journaling as well. Activate mind, body, spirit. Grow in mind, body, and spirit. Then you can take on the day much more powerfully, much more intentionally, and you can be intentional about cultivating and creating power in your own life. If you leave it to to default, it's not going to happen. You're going to show up oftentimes feeling weak and ineffective. So check it out. Hit me a message so I can be of any support to you in these ideas. Peace and love to wherever you are. 30-day live video challenge, day eight. We are noblemen. Bye-bye.